subscribe channel, and click on bell icon to receive notification from the channel. Subscribe, because it's free. Do we have any other non-Muslim guests on either the sister's mic or from any of the brother's mics? Yes, we have one here. Go ahead. Uh, she doesn't want to reveal her identity, so I'll be asking her question. Okay. The question is, is it enough to have faith in Allah in your heart alone? Or do you have to declare it in public? Sister, that's a very important question. Before I answer the question, I request the non-Muslim brothers and sisters that this is the opportunity. This is the last session of the convention, Dubai International Peace Convention. If you have any question on Islam, on Christianity, on Hinduism, this is the opportunity. Please feel free to come to the microphone. You can ask any question. You can even criticize Quran. I'm young. I can take it. This is the opportunity. This is the last session. Please don't feel shy. Come on the microphone and clarify your doubt. The sister asked a very important question that is it sufficient for a person to have faith in Almighty God and believe in Him or should he or she declare it? Sister, the most important criteria is that that person should have faith in Almighty God. Declaring in public or to others is not compulsory. If the sister feels that there is danger to her life, she may have problems or maybe society would harm her. In this case, having faith in the heart is sufficient. But if there is no danger to life, no danger to that person, declaring is better because then that person can follow Islam freely. Because if you have faith and you hide it from others, then you have to practice Islam secretly. That becomes difficult. So if you really fear your life or you fear that somebody will harm you, then declaring is not a fard, it's not compulsory. But if there is no such problem, declaring is better because you can practice your faith openly and you need not practice it secretly. Hope that answers the question, sister. Thank you.